There's no way. It's hard to get back. Yeah, Dev. No, the f not. <laughs> 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 Three point and do the do the AI do some. Sh I don't know why I don't. It's supposed to be a moment. This supposed to be a moment. This supposed to be a moment. What good is being the one when you the only one that knows it? It's the ISO guy sensei, the greatest 2K player in existence. And in this video, man, I'm going to be delivering you guys a two-way playmaker with Hall of Fame shooting badges, the ultimate catfish build. Allen Iverson, Gary Payton, Chris Paul-esque build. You know, the midget stopper. You know, soon people are going to be making heli midgets on current Gen 2. This is actually somewhat of a midget and but the thing is he's gonna be able to play defense like the midgets can on next gen but before we get into that make sure you subscribe if you new nigga hit the like button it helps the algorithm comment down below your favorite build that you played with so far it helps the algorithm <laughs> and turn on the post notice watch this full vid so you really understand the build if you would like to make it this is even a build i would make you know it's a possible you know duo ball handler or main ball handler or a very toxic 2v2 build we're talking about a speed boost and perimeter lock my boy you know now um for the pie chart we are going to go with this pie chart right here this is probably the best version of this type of build for for the style that we're going with okay we are going to choose the speed pie chart man okay you know real Allen Iverson best pound for pound player in NBA history y'all let me know who you think the best pound for pound player in NBA history is where y'all rank Allen Iverson man <clears throat> so we got the close shot up to 84 right so y'all know Mike Wang is a, is a terrible uh, gameplay developer, you know. We still are like accidentally fading real close, you know, when we mean to dunk it or, you know, we're fading to the side. You know, it's, it's real dumb. Like it's an old, it's like, come on, man, fix the shit. So, I mean, you got an 84, so it's going to help you, my boy. But we only doing this for uh, finishing badges. Max out that driving layup, max out that dunk. You know, you're going to be able to finish in contact, not just spam the threes, but you're going to be able to spam the threes with the D-Row shit. You feel me? And you're going to have Hall of Fame defense, and you can spam. Come on, nigga. And you ain't got no low three like the two-way playmakers. Nah, we're going to have a high three, my boy. We ain't going to have 20 badges. I, I lied to y'all niggas, man. Let me, let me bring it down. We're going to have 16. Three finishing badges, 16 showing. Okay. Playmaking is very important. <laughs> they make so many playmaking badges that matter. It's kind of crazy. So this is kind of low, but I mean, this is what you got to sacrifice if you want Hall of Fame shooting and defense, you know? Um, you're still going to be able to move. You're going to wiggle. You're still going to have 99 speed. You know, a badge tier is a more of a... um. They're like attributes to your shit, so you could break over 100. If you already have 99 speed, you still... I'm pretty sure you're still going to be able to move pretty devious with this nigga. If any of y'all make this build, let me know because I would love to use it and drop vids on it. Um, perimeter defense, 85. All this shit going to go up, man. We're going to bring this block to a 46. And we're going to max out that rebound. So it's a 3, 16, 13, 19. It's a, it's a nice little layout. Now, this build, I'm going to show you, bro. I don't think nobody got this shit in the game. So, if you one of them little unique niggas and shit, ain't nobody got this shit. This exact type of build. Ain't nobody ever got my exact type of builds. That's why y'all need to check out my shit. Or go watch my uh super hilarious gameplays, man. We're going to make them burly to appear even bigger than what we are. Okay? And we are going to make this nigga six foot. Okay? Six foot, and I'm gonna show you why. Okay, 
Um, we're gonna be able to abuse mismatch with this nigga, and we're also gonna be able to stop people from abusing mismatch, and we're gonna have crazy high speeds, and we're gonna be able to spam the D rows on a Hall of Fame shooting and a Hall of Fame defensive that can dunk build. This is a you know, this a nice build, bro. I'm trying to tell you, man. Hey man, make sure y'all follow the Twitch, man. Y'all ever wanna run with me or watch some entertaining gameplay? We're gonna make them 163. Follow all my socials. And look, so at 99, you're gonna be able to unlock the D Rose and shit like that. Well, not 99, probably like 98, 97. So it is a build you have to grind before then. You could use Zach Levine or some other shit. Um. Okay, so we're gonna have the wingspan right here, bro. So it's like, you know, he's looking crazy. He's gonna have the, the 99 speeds and excels. You know, the D-Rose, all this, you know, real. And look, these are all his takeovers, man. I would say most OP would be the lock take. You know, really get devious with niggas. You could do the playmaker take. It's all up to you how you wanna use this nigga. I would pick lock take on him, though. And voila. You got that Allen Iverson bill, my boy. I just test out these badges. How y'all like Curry this year? Y'all have y'all used it? Man, you could rock something like this, man. I think this shit ass. This this whole man. Well, I mean, we are gonna have different ones, so maybe you know, I would probably rock this. See if bronze is good enough. Um, because we are gonna have, I think, so, the tomahawk dunks. I'm not, I'm not too sure. But yeah, man, you know, do whatever with your fucking finisher. Man, honestly, for the shooting, I'll probably do something like this, bro. It's it's a toughie, man. I don't know. I don't know how. I have to test hot zone on lower, um, lower shit and really see, bro. And like, you know, because I could do something like this. I don't know, bro. I don't know. 16, you, it's, it's kind of tough. Blinders is OP as fuck, bro. I'm, I'm trying to tell you, my nigga. That shit is OP as hell. I don't, I don't know what I need hot zone on. But, I mean, something like this would, would be cool, bro. Or, like, if anything, bro, like, you don't even need all this. You you could you could rock it like these. You could do something like that. Or you could try to do the bronze shit. See, see what you really like, man. I think you could get away with this, you know, ha have your badges like these, or maybe like this, or, you know, if you are getting plucked, you don't have to take one of these golds and put it like that. Um, bullet passer might be good enough, bronze or silver, not too sure, but this seems like a decent-ish layout, man. Y'all let me know what layout y'all would do for this build. Man, everybody ISO in these days, man. So I'll probably rock something like this. And then you could switch up the badges. Um, but I I I think I think this will really be valid. You know, niggas niggas is really just ISO and uh or at least the comp people, the people using screens, you know, you, you could you could duo, you know, play two up and you know your your badges will run different if you're doing screens, but if you play comp, niggas is doing pick and pops and trying to ISO. I I don't know, man. I think bronze this would, would still be good and if not bro you could do something like this you know all all, all up to you man I, I think this would be a nice layout and yeah man that's the end of the video make sure y'all subscribe if you're new hit that goddamn like button for the algorithm comment down below for the algorithm turn on the post notice appreciate all y'all boys man make sure y'all follow me on twitch and um, yeah, I'm out this all. But hey, hey, here we go again. Yeah. Here, here we go again. People talking this, but when this hit the fan, everything I'm that made me. Now break it down. Yo, off the top of the dome, dome.